All right, good morning everybody. We are getting off the boat here near Nuremberg. And today we're going to do the uh, trials and rally grounds tour. Sorry about making you look right in the sun there. So I'm excited for that. I got some extra free water from the boat that they give you. And uh, I guess this is the name of the place where we dock. Uh, Hoffengebiet. Beautiful morning. Grounds tour. Okay. Hello and welcome on board. My name is Sigrid. I prefer Ziggy and I will be your guide. Which is northeast of this place here. We're so now on the uh, Autobahn back on the way to Nuremberg and you can see these cars going by. Climbing ahead is Berlin. When you travel on this motorway between Nuremberg and Munich, both cities are in Bavaria, uh, the two biggest cities in Bavaria, uh, you need approximately one hour and a half if there is no traffic jam. Uh, when you take a look to the left, you see that train coming over there. It's a speed train which can drive at 300 kilometers per hour. doesn't do it all the time, but it can. And then the connection between Nuremberg and Munich is done in less than one hour. That is a Siemens product, by the way. <coughs> Yes, before you ask, at the moment there is no general speed limit here. Um, so that means if you traveled in a smaller car, you could drive it f as fast as you like, as this one here, for example, um, but not on the bus. Now, the buses have a general speed limit of 100 kilometers per hour. Uh, so we have everything in kilometers, we have no miles. Later on, you will see the, um, the speed will be reduced to 120 kilometers, that is... Right, we're getting off the bus at our first little stop here in Nuremberg. It's the Palace of Justice is what we have here. there. We have the symphonic orchestra here too. the old town that we saw a little bit earlier. And I believe we're maybe in this building here. It's the Congress Hall. And I think we have to go upstairs now to see all the expeditions and we use these little things here for the audio tour. That they
tons of rooms like this in here, all brick buildings. Uh, the, uh, of course, of a ritual section. It's the Hall of uh, Racism and Anti-Semitism. They're playing a video now on our ears of Hitler's speech. This is the, uh, the uh, Soviet War of Annihilation. Next section. Nuremberg Trials area, which we went by those buildings earlier. From the Nuremberg trial section, we we'll go into the Nazi Party rally grounds after 1945. So from the last section of the uh, tour there. You can come out here and get a full view of this area. It's pretty big. As you can see they're not really doing anything with it. Just kind of letting it sit here. I think we were supposed to drive into here but they had it closed before. This is just back in front outside. This was supposed to be an enclosed Congress Hall. I read German if you tell me what this says. It's time to get out of here. I hope you enjoyed seeing the exposition center here that they built into the uh, old Nazi Congress Hall. We'll continue uh, with the rest of the tour. I think we're probably going straight back to the boat after this. So that's the end of the tour here for uh, Nuremberg. Actually, uh, we didn't get to see the Zeppelin field, so they took us through the downtown area a little bit. Thank you. This is Roth, which is, I believe is the docking area if you start your river cruise here in Nuremberg as well. And we got the Avalon Panorama coming in behind our vessel here. Here comes the uh, Amarina bias. Another Amma Waterways vessel. We'll see if APT is charting chartering the vessel or not. Kind of going slow, but blasting uh, side jets there. Oh, here comes the Amarina. It's getting close here. We're not moving. I think we're just waiting for them to go by and then we're going to go down the canal most likely. And I think this one has the uh, swimming pool on top. I know it's one of their uh, newer models. Hey, I want to go swimming. Can I come? Yeah. Uh, 
That's nice, they got full balconies out here. Little dividers in between. Look right inside their room, see what's going on, if anything. They got pink roses or some uh, flowers in there. I couldn't tell exactly what they were. See a lot of people here. It's nice when you're outside balcony, you wash your clothes in the shower and whoop, <laughs> there's a guy in bed there. Hang your clothes out to dry on the uh, chairs outside. Look at him, he's got his socks uh, squashed up under the glass, drying them out there in the window. He's got his pants going on up there too. All right, so now we are actually going down in our first lock. Now it opened the window, but you can see all these bugs out here are gonna fly in. So I think we've reached uh, the height of where we're gonna be on the rivers, and uh, don't know if we're on the Danube yet, but um, I guess we will be here fairly soon. So we are going down, down, down into the dungeon. Well, good evening, everybody. We've uh, had dinner already on board uh, today. Uh, so, cool day in town in Nuremberg. I enjoyed seeing the uh, uh, area there in Nuremberg. We uh, it wasn't the normal tour that they did for us because the Zeppelin Field, which I didn't really recall existed, was closed. But apparently, that's the, one of the most important things to see if you're going to Nuremberg because that's one of the few uh, big things that the Nazis uh, f actually built and finished in, in Nuremberg, in that area. But it was cool to see the uh, Congress Hall, and you didn't really catch a scope of it until the end when you went out on the plank there and saw how big that hall really was. And, you know, it was outdoor, but they meant to cover it and make it an indoor facility for their Congress, which is huge and amazing and unbelievable. Um, so, you know, standard good dinner on board. And uh, tomorrow is actually going to be a good day. It's Regensburg. It's, our, I think, our second to last stop in Germany. After that, it's Passau. And so tomorrow we actually have a full day in Regensburg. 8.30 uh, is when we get off for the first tour. And then all aboard is at 6.45. So in the morning, I'm doing that one, the Abbey and Danube Gorge tour. You pay for it. Right now, it's 47 euros. And after that, for those who do the pay tour, you get a a free walking tour in the afternoon uh, in uh, Regensburg itself. So hopefully I'll buy a you know a piece of junk or a souvenir in one of the shops there. So that's it. Uh, today I've uh, edited about three or four videos. Uh, of course uh, they're being uploaded but not uh, to YouTube at the moment unfortunately. So those will be up uh, as soon as I can get them up. So let's end the vlog here for tonight. Thanks again for watching. Uh, thanks for subscribing, liking the videos, and of course sharing them with your friends who you think might be interested in uh, seeing my travels and, and that type of thing. So, uh, so thanks again uh, for watching, and uh, stay tuned for the next one. Keep in touch.